Hey guys, I wanted to relook at an application today that I checked out quite a while ago. It's called SoftKey Z and it's had a fair number of updates and improvements and it's just an awesome application. Now, if you haven't heard of it before, basically it allows you to customize your on-screen navigation keys. So you can change the colors, you can change the theming, you can even change the entire icon with something in your gallery if you want to. It gives you a lot of control. Now it does require root, I'm on the stock ROM here but I am rooted so you will need that and BusyBox installed for this to work properly. And it is a paid application but it is worth it, I will put the links in the description so you can go ahead and buy it if you like the look of it. Yeah let's go ahead and check it out. Okay so once you've been through the initial setup this is a screen you should see, it's a pretty simple application to use. This bar actually allows you to preview the changes before you hit apply which is of course very useful. And here are all the different icons that come pre-installed, you can see all the different colours, all the different themes and you don't have to pick an entire row here you can pick and choose exactly what you want so for example if you want a green home button a purple back button and a red menu button you can do that you can see the changes right there if you like that you can just hit the tick and it will restart your device I'll show you that a little bit later you can also save that configuration if it's something you really love and you can go ahead and edit those or delete them and if you hit the X button, it basically takes you back to stock and you'll see the icons are now back to the stock ones. If you actually want to import a button from your gallery, you can do that as well. Go to import buttons at the top, pick which uh, sort of button it's going to be. So home button, for example, and then you just choose the gallery and you choose the image. That's as simple as it is. Now, you also have a backup option here as well. This will basically allow you to restore your backup of your previous icons. So the stock icons, which is also a useful feature. And... Something that this app didn't have when I first reviewed it was the online gallery and this is pretty damn sweet. So basically it allows people to share their creations and you can go ahead and download them and check out all the different ones here. You can see there's one from Android Place which is basically using these new Google buttons which everyone thinks is going to be included in the next big Google update. We'll have to wait and see on that. But you can just simply download these. You can see it's downloading the images from the server and there they are. Now I'm actually going to apply one of these to show you what it looks like so we'll hit the tick working on data, device will restart, so this just takes a few seconds. Okay, so the device is restarted here and you can see we now have those themed navigation buttons that we downloaded from the SoftKey Z app. So it works really well and it's an excellent application for anyone who loves to customize every inch of their Android device. It really is, it works really well. Now if you do want to go back to your stock icons, you can just go ahead and hit the backup hit apply backup and again it's just going to go ahead and restore these, reboot your device and when it comes back online in a few seconds it should have the stock icons back. And there you go, you can see we're back on the stock icon. So it's a pretty awesome application, definitely give it a go if you love to customize every inch of your Android device. Yeah, let me know what you guys think. Peace out.